So I gave myself a few days to process before I made this book review um, on this book. I've read the first two books of this series, now the Boys of Tommen series, um, Binding 13 and Keeping 13. And uh, my heart. Um, there's a piece of my soul that is going to forever be in these books. And for everyone who I said when I first unboxed these way back in, I think, March, and I was like, I wonder why it's on fire. <laughs> I know why it's on fire. And it hurts. It hurts. Ugh, this book was so freaking good. The love story in these two books, Binding and Keeping 13, absolutely incredible. Okay, I understand. I understand the hype. I understand why everybody says these people become like your family. I would be happy to live in this world. I would be okay if someone just like took me out and put me in the Boys of Tommen world because I want to be friends with all these people. I still need more Gipsy. I need more Gerard Gibson in my life. He is my absolute favorite character of the series. Johnny, also incredible, okay? There are so many times that I was laughing out loud in these books and so many times that I wanted to bawl my eyes out in these books and then other times that I was just swooning because again, it was top notch. I am obsessed. This is going to be like one of my favorite book series of all time now. Like easily it has been moved up because I loved everything about this book. So check the trigger warnings before you read these books because these things will go from like happy-go-lucky to devastating in a matter of pages. Like not even joking you. It is so extreme from like one side to the next. Um, I, I have nothing else but besides that I love this and I'm going to miss this and I'm going to probably have to pick this up again very soon and read this again because I cannot stop thinking about them. I just love them so much. I just love them so much. And thank you to everyone who was like screaming at me to read The Boys of Tommen because I did it. I finally read the first two books. I'm giving myself a few more days before I read uh, Saving Six and Redeeming Six because I'm not sure I'm ready for that story. Everyone told me that that one is arguably harder to read than this one, um, more devastating. So I'm going to give myself a little bit more time to process the first devastating love story that I read before I jump into the next. But I love the series. If you guys have not read the Boys of Tommen series, please stop what you're doing. Add it to your TBR because Chloe Walsh writes fan freaking tastic books. And she's like, it's one of the best dialogue in these books that I've ever read in my life. I literally sit, feel like I'm sitting down and like, and I'm engaged in a conversation. Like I'm sitting there, I'm watching it happen. And then I like have to like look up and realize that I'm reading a book. I mean, these books, incredible. 10 out of 10, 100 out of whatever you want, read these books. I can't recommend them more.